Number 8. Here is vividly tone 1953 Elizabeth II farthing from Great Britain. Proof superb gem that was graded as PR66 red and brown by NGC. It is a relatively scarce and valuable coin, especially in this high grade. PR66 indicates a coin that is in excellent, 66, condition. Red and brown refers to the color of the coin. In this case, it means that the coin still retains some of its original red coloration along with some brown toning, which is common for older copper coins. This one displays attractive neon blue and pinkish hues as well. It was sold for $216 on October 20, 2023. Number 7. This is 1967 half crown struck on a Colombian peso planchet. Graded in mint state 63 by PCGS. Despite blank size difference all letterings are present and device elements are mostly well defined. Surfaces are void of large distractions. It was sold for $384. Number 6. Here is 1978 Elizabeth II 10 cents from Hong Kong struck on a copper planchet. Graded in mint state 64 red and brown by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, normally meant for a nickel brass planchet, this erroneous 10 cent piece instead gleams with copper red. A very well preserved and highly individual piece that fetched a sum of $1,440 at auction. Number 5. This is undated Elizabeth II 50 cents from Hong Kong struck on a 5 cents planchet. Graded in mint state 64 by PCGS. A curious piece struck on a much too small planchet. While the date is entirely absent due to the limited space, this would be 50 cents piece belongs to a four year type. All the details that do appear are crisp and freshly struck, and abundant luster elevates the look of this intriguing error. It was sold for $1,440. Number 4. A modern masterpiece. The exquisite 2000 Elizabeth II gold 5 pounds from Great Britain. Graded in mint state 66 by PCGS. Obverse side features fourth crown portrait of Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II right, wearing the girls of Great Britain and Ireland tiara, legend around. On the reverse St. George slaying the dragon right, date and designer's initials in exerg. Actual gold weight is 1,177 ounces it was sold for $2,400. Number 3. This is 1978 Elizabeth II 10 cents from Hong Kong struck on aluminum planchet. An error coin graded as MS63 by PCGS. This unusual mint error shows 10 cent dies struck onto an undersized and misshapen aluminum planchet instead of the proper nickel brass planchet. The resulting coin features an obverse with curious curved rims distorted detail, paired with a comparatively crisp reverse strike. A pleasing gray tone and rather high level of preservation make this an extremely intriguing error piece. It was sold for $2,280 on October 15, 2023. Number 2. This is 1981 Elizabeth II $2 struck on a copper planchet. Graded in mint state 64 red and brown by PCGS. According to Stax Bowers, normally struck on a scallop copper nickel planchet, this $2 piece instead appears on a round copper planchet. Slightly off-center to boot. Hints of the intended scallop rims can be identified. This intriguing specimen is well preserved and quite charming. It was sold for $2,280. Number 1. And this is 1964 H. Elizabeth II 5 cents coin from Hong Kong. The coin was struck by Birmingham Mint. Graded in Mint State 64 by PCGS. A mid century key date to the Hong Kong series. This specimen certainly does not lack for beauty and appeal. The strike on this example is strong, with rich details and a wholesome golden bronze glow of luster. This tremendous piece fetched a sum of $9,000 at October 2023 Hong Kong auction. That's wraps up today's episode. Thanks for watching this video. Please make sure to smash subscribe and notification buttons below to help us grow and reach more numismatic enthusiasts on YouTube. God's will, see you in the next episode.